An expander is for patients whose upper jaw is narrow. It gently widens the upper arch by stretching the center palatal connective suture. The expander is prescribed only prior to completion of growth. A parent or the patient should adjust the expander daily as instructed until the palate has been widened to the desired position. It is then left in place for approximately four months without further adjustment while new bone fills in the center palatal suture or healing occurs. Expect to see a space appear between your upper two front teeth as the palate is widened. Before the expander feels comfortable, you may sense some initial pressure and expect to feel a tingling or itch under the appliance. You may also feel a tingling sensation across the bridge of the nose or feel pressure in the cheek area. A special key is used to activate the expander. Insert the key in its slot. It will not touch the roof of your mouth. Next, push the key all the way from front to back. Then remove the key. Typically, you will rotate the screw in the expander to the point where you can see the next slot or hole. This demonstration shows the results of an expander over time. Your expander should be cleaned on a regular basis with cool water, toothpaste, and toothbrush. If your appliance is cemented in, brush it as you would your teeth, paying attention to the bands that hold it in. Brush gently along the gum line to remove the plaque. If your appliance is like a retainer, take it out of your mouth and brush it with the same brush and toothpaste as you would your teeth. Plaque sticks to plastic better than teeth, so extra brushing is important, especially where the wires join the plastic. Brush often, at least three times a day for two minutes at a time. Call our office for an appointment if a band feels loose, you think the appliance needs to be checked, you need advice, or you experience unusual symptoms. After expansion of the palate, you will be ready for braces or other appliances to complete orthodontic treatment.